Vaporizers, e-cigarettes, whatever you call them, business is booming. We estimate that the, the vaping market uh, worldwide is probably between uh, four and ten billion uh, dollars uh, per year. There was almost no, um, you know, vaping or vaporizers four or five years ago. Uh, so the trend is is definitely um, very uh, up. E-cigarettes work by heating up liquid nicotine until it turns to vapor. There's no tobacco burned. Smokio, a Paris-based maker of e-cigs, is taking the tech a step further with a Bluetooth connection to your phone. Lots of people were trying to quit smoking using uh, electronic cigarettes and uh, they were uh, very often a bit lost in you know, how much they, they were uh, using uh, these uh, devices, how much nicotine they were getting in the end. Exactly as uh, Drobone or Fitbit would help you track how much you know, uh, you're moving, uh, we, uh, we want to help people be aware of how much they're using their uh, vaporizer. How many puffs uh, you're taking, how much nicotine uh, you're vaporizing every day or every week. There's limited research on the health effects of e-cigarettes. The FDA has asked for a rule change allowing it to regulate them. But companies like Smokio already market them as a way to kick the smoking habit. Our goal is to target adult smokers who've been smoking for years or more and who want to try something different that can only have a positive impact given that they're going to try to switch off smoking when they do that. And Smokio's app can even stop you when you can't stop yourself. You can actually control your vaporizer, set limits if you want to make sure you're not vaping too much. Uh, for instance, if you reach 100 puffs or 200 puffs, whatever the limits you want to set for yourself, it can switch off the device for the day and you have to wait for the next day to be able to use it again. Smokio says the added willpower isn't the only benefit to using their technology. By you know switching from smoking to vaping, every day you'll save some, you'll save some cash and after a couple of weeks or months when you see the amount, you're like, wow, I saved you know, $100, $1,000 by you know, switching switching from smoking to vaping and hopefully it will help you, you know, uh, keep on the, on, on the right track. It's not just Smokio. Other companies are looking to quantify your vaping. They're hoping that the data could be the incentive you need to quit for good. Lori Siegel, CNN Money, New York.